Hey guys, this is Matt Core from controlpaint.com, and today we're just going to start out by talking about two very basic brush stroke types. But as a quick reminder, if you look below the post, you'll find links for free brushes and worksheets, as well as in depth premium series available in the Control Paint store. So, when we're talking about basic brush stroke types, really I think of it as two categories you have opaque paint, and then you have translucent paint. I'll pick a little more visible color here and you can really see what I'm saying. So you can see how those two sort of fundamentally behave differently. One you can see through and one you can't. Well, the way that we do this in Photoshop is a little different than the way we do it with traditional paint. So I'm gonna delete these layers here and we'll explain which is which. So if I wanna paint opaque paint, that's easy. To do that, all I do is make a new layer and then you'll notice this little rectangle here says normal, which is called a blending mode, and normal is the default. And in this case, normal means opaque. Now if I make another layer, and this time I'm gonna change this little drop down to the multiply option. And now I'm gonna paint with the same exact color. And you can see this one looks transparent. You might call this a glazed layer, as in I'm glazing with translucent paint like oil paints. So really that's all there is to it. It's called a blending mode and it is a property of a layer. So I'll often paint with a normal opaque layer, but sometimes when I wanna have sort of a glazed look, I'll make a new layer, set it to multiply, and then this will allow everything on this layer to have sort of a glaze look. Now, one thing worth noting is if you merge one layer down onto the layer below it, you'll see that it absorbs the blending mode of the lower layer. So here, what was previously a glazed layer and a normal layer, when I flatten the two together, they're both a normal layer. So I encourage you to just mess around with both these. Get out the brush tool, pick a basic brush, and try working on normal layers and on multiply layers. Have fun, guys. Thanks for coming to the site.